Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. It's Eva from Bohemian Crafting and today I'm coming to share with you my today's crafting uh, project. Uh, I'm making my own kind of washi tape or tape. I'm using double-sided tape and loads of my <laughs> scraps. I'm big saver. Uh, through the process of creating journals, I'm saving even small bits and pieces because I do love my book pages. Even small pieces like this, I'm thinking I will use one day. And as I'm saving it for last four years, <laughs> I've got a huge amount of these scraps. I've got also a huge amount of scraps of wrapping paper, brown wrapping paper. And uh, today I've got an idea. Uh, I'm decorating my journals, these two. In this journal, I used uh, washi tapes to decorate my pages. See, I don't have any washi tape here. <laughs> I want to show you washi tapes and I don't have. Yeah, here. I used washi tapes to decorate my book pages in this journal. But this one, it will be a little bit darker. And I was thinking what kind of washi tape I want to use and then I was thinking I want to use um, kind of mix of book pages and stuff like that and this one it's a little bit sim similar like when you are making snippets for your pages it's so relaxing I can tell you I'm, I'm really enjoying it so that's why I'm, I'm coming to share with you take your scraps of coffee dyed tea dyed paper turkey Take your off cuts from book pages. Just sit down, put some good music on or some movie you like. Sit down and enjoy that creative process. I'm taking always small piece of book page and rip it off. Then small piece. It doesn't even have to have some kind of order. How you will stick it, you will stick it. It's totally up to you. This is very relaxing craft. And what is the best about it, that I am, uh, I am using these small pieces, which I just can't throw to bin. I just can't. It's, it's my paper and I love, love my paper. And um, as you can see, even those small pieces can be used somehow. When, when I do have pieces around I can use the scissors and cut it off or what I tried here here on the start I've got here this um, nail I think you call it that nail file so what I'm doing I'm just kind of sanding that edge and it makes really beautiful beautiful book page washi tape i really love that result look at that and it's really just just sticking the paper on the tape and rip it off and with that sanding where i don't have book page like here i can uh, sand my paper and that dust from that sanding paper will stick on that sticky piece or i can try with another oh not this one I like this one. I can try with another book page to go there and maybe add a little bit of glue. If that will be not too much successful, good. So I'm making my own collage tape. I, I'm gonna call it collage tape because it is actually collage. And this way. And it's really very re relaxing. And I'm so happy I can use those small bits and pieces. Because I really love those small bits and pieces. Look, here is number. Here is some small number. If I will want to find it on book page. Or if I will want to cut it from book page. Just because of that small number. I will have to take all book page. You know, <laughs> that's why I'm saving those things. <laughs> because there is small number. There is some board. <laughs> Yeah, I'm a big saver. And I do have quite a lot of these small pieces. That's why I was thinking very hard how to use it. And I actually like this type of craft. So now I do have piece. 
I'm going to take my scissors and cut off those small pieces around. And sand that edge because that sanded edge, it just look perfect. And here is not glued properly. So I'm going to use a little bit of glue. And glue it nicely. And once I will want to use it in my journals, because it's double-sided tape, I, I still have that other side of my double-sided tape. So here I will just take off that backing. And I do have my tape ready to use in my journals so my today's craft will be making my collage tape look how beautiful it looks like and more different papers maybe i will have a look if i do have some off cuts from ledger paper i definitely do have i know that i've got maybe i've got them here somewhere Yeah, see, from my ledger papers, pieces like this, they are kind of useless. <laughs> but with this tape, I can use it, even those small bits and pieces. So that's why I'm, I'm happy that I do have some project I can use for those small off cuts. And I was thinking I have to share this one. I have to. Because I know that I am not only one who is saving everything. We do love our papers, right? And I'm not gonna apologize that I'm saving my papers. My sons are starting to be worried about my health because they said, Mom, you're hard. <laughs> yeah, I'm not surprised they said that. That's why I have to. I have to start to use it. I've got so many boxes of these teeny mini bits and pieces. And I'm telling you, this is so relaxing. And I actually like really much this sand edge of that of that washi tape or of that uh, collage tape. It looks so cool with that sanding edge. It looks very, very warm. So this is my very quick sharing for today. For all those my friends who are like me, who are saving any kind of small pieces like this. So come to join me with this type of craft. Because guys, it's very relaxing. So that's all what I wanted to share for today. I hope I gave you some good idea how to spend your time. Thank you so much for visiting me today. Take care about yourself. Have a wonderful day and I will see you soon. Bye.